Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Martin. I work as a delivery driver working with um, Amazon Flex, uh, Stuart, Uber Eats, Deliveroo and as of today, it being the 19th of July, um, Just Eat, which has uh, taken the contract from Stuart starting from today. Uh, so um, I just want to do a little video just to uh, let you know how, um, as a newbie, I get on this week uh, delivering with the Just Eat app. Um, so it's currently about 9.30. I've just done the school run. Um, and my shift starts at 10.15. A uh, few people I know are already out on the road. And um, some of the feedback I've got from is a tiny bit worrying. Some of the jobs that have been sent are not ideal. Um, so Exeter, unfortunately, is absolutely horrendous for traffic around the town centre and there is nowhere to park so if you're a car driver going to the city centre or over to Alfington is kind of a no-no because those two areas are just there you just can't really access it very well with a car I mean you can get to Alfington but the traffic is so bad that you'd be stuck for potentially a rush hour like 30-40 minutes trying to get to a restaurant in Alfington um, and from what I've heard, there's lots of jobs in the high street and Alfreton for car drivers, which is seems absolutely crazy. There's plenty of, with Stuart, there's plenty of work in the normal area that I deliver in. So my plan is to pack up, get in the car in a sec and drive over to where I normally deliver. And hopefully I'll get orders over there and stay over there. Um... As far as like the high street jobs go and the alpha jobs go, my plan is to just try and ignore them and uh, see how it goes. Um, so this week I am doing a seven day week. At the end of the week, I'll let you know how I got on. Uh, it's Wednesday today or Monday and Tuesday. I just did a few hours just because I don't know what the rest of the week's going to bring. Although I've got a load of hours on Just Eat, obviously I've no idea how much money I might make from them. So I've done like roughly like 10, 11 hours and made about 150 quid, 160 quid. For the first two days I'll um I'll pop a little thing there saying how I've done so far but yeah uh I'll check back in for, with you throughout the week and then at the end of the week we'll uh we'll see how it's gone see so my uh shift has now started with uh just eat it's not a particularly great start um probably my fault to be fair though um I didn't hear it going off when uh when they were offering me a uh, order so um when I went in Tesco and bought a sandwich and when I got back out, it said, you've rejected an order. Oh, hmm. Maybe I'll just make sure my phone's turned up. Stupid idiot. So uh, that's my first hour done uh, is the shift. Um, obviously, I missed that first order and it took quite a long time to get another one, which is a bit worrying. But um, since then, I had two orders, which were both pretty easy ones, to be fair. And I got about just shy of 12 quid. It's obviously not ideal. I want to be aiming for about 15, really. But it is a sunny day, and generally it's a lot quieter in Exeter when it's sunny. Um, so I've got better that in mind. Um, I can see how the rest of the shift goes. Um, I've basically got a double shift, so I think there's like a half an hour in the middle. Um, if it's not busy enough on Just Just Eat by this afternoon, then I'll, um, I'll make sure I've got all the apps on and just have to pause Just Eat. But um, yeah, 12 quid for first hour considering I accidentally missed one this is probably what I would normally have made um, the app itself seems a bit like weird like there's quite a lot to do once you swipe for this tick for that um, and the maps aren't very well integrated as well so not not perfect but I mean so far it's not too bad for me um, I've heard some other people say they don't like it but we'll see how it goes you know give it at least the, the end to the end of the week before I make proper judgment. So it's now quarter past two. Uh, so that's my first four hour block done or four hour shift done with Just Eat. Um, did £46.50, so about £11.60 or 70 an hour. Which is obviously not ideal when I'm aiming for about 15 because um, that's gross without all the expenses taken off. Um, but you know, it's a really sunny day and probably normally I wouldn't do that much. So, um, yeah, not too bad. I'm going to stop and have a quick bit of a break now, uh, because at half past two, I've got another shift for four hours to so half six, at least hopefully 
maybe uh, they might extend it and um, we'll see how it goes but yeah so far not great but to be expected with the hot weather hot weather in Exeter is not good everyone goes to the beach because we got a million beaches within half an hour anyway let's see how the rest of the day goes all right guys there is one question i'm wondering if anyone can answer me so um i got offered a amazon block while i'm on my just eat uh, shift um and i have paused a couple of times to do a quick cheeky deliveroo um and that's been fine um but i offered this amazon box only an hour uh morrison's and it's like it was 22 pound 50 um which is obviously quite good so just wondering i didn't accept it because i was worried that i'd get booted off for whatever for the rest of my shift um but if i went and did that would that impact can so anybody know put the answer down in the comments if you know so that's the end of my uh second four hour shift so uh it's eight hours so i've done over two shifts with a uh, 15 minutes in the middle i also took about 30 minutes of break time as well um to have something to eat go to the toilet all that sort of stuff uh so um this is how i did for the first day uh actually pleasantly surprised to be fair uh so on um on just eat itself uh 94 pounds and 46p on uh uber eats five pounds and 62p sorry i've got notes down here and then on delivery 15 pounds and 67p so that's not too bad and also a little greasy bonus so let me just go to the calculator work out how much that all is so if i've done my sums correctly that is 120 pounds and 75p uh, so as I said, I did roughly seven and a half hours when you take the uh, breaks out. Uh, so it works out at £16.10 £16 an hour, uh, which is, um, that's good. On a sunny day especially, I'm pretty happy with that. Um, I'm aiming normally for about £15 to £20, uh, so we're falling in that bracket. Happy, 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 happy. So obviously guys, that was just day one. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I'm going to go on and record for the rest of the week and let you know um, at the end of the week how I did. Uh, but I thought I'd just put up how day one went. Um, hopefully I'll catch you at the end of the week as well. Cheers.